so before I get the video started, I am defending Sword and Shield, but I do think there should be a national Pokédex. <laughs> I know it's an unpopular opinion, but I think Pokemon Sword and Shield will be a good set of games. Right now, hating the game is kind of the popular thing to do, so people will say it will suck. But most of them haven't even played the game yet, and with everybody saying the game will suck, that's just causing more people to hop on that bandwagon, and then they'll say the game will be terrible too. But for the people thinking the game is awful, I have three reasons why Pokemon Sword and Shield will be a great set of games. I mean, this is my opinion after all. So a lot of complaints I've seen have to do with the graphics, but what's wrong with the graphics? I mean, they're better than, than Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. They're actually 3D, which, you know, the 3DS and 2DS kind of did well, but the Switch has better processing power, which makes it better for the 3D graphics. And... The game even has a third-person camera, so you can literally get any angle. It makes hunting for Pokemon in grass completely different. But, before you say the gameplay lags, the people that played the game played an unfinished version because the trailer says that the gameplay was not final, so they will be working on that. People also complain about the lack of Mega Evolutions, Z-Moves, and Pokemon Transfer. While not being able to transfer Pokemon is disappointing, they did add in Dynamax Pokemon as a replacement for Z-Moves, a good choice in my opinion. Z-Moves were boring and didn't really add much strategy to the game, but the Dynamax Pokemon completely changes the whole strategic aspect of the game. It's basically a mega evolution because you get more health, attack power, and new attacks for three turns. This completely changes up strategy in PvP games, and this is why I think it's a good addition. Another thing people aren't very happy about is that they say the legendaries look like a Dark Souls boss. I'm not going to lie, they do, which is hilarious to me, but that's not really a bad thing. Besides, all of the other Pokemon that they've revealed look pretty cool, including the starters. Personally, I'm on Team Grookey, but if you're on Team Sobble or Scorbunny, hey, you're valid too. Overall, the game has a lot going for it. It has great graphics, great Pokemon, plus the Dynamax Pokemon. And did I mention that there are actually raid battles? We finally get a real co-op function. If it had a national Pokédex, no one would be complaining, as that is the only real problem with the game. People need to stop hating all the game just because everyone else is, and look at all the good things in it. Most of them haven't even played the game anyway. If you agree or disagree, let me know in the comments below. I would love to read your opinions, and I'll see you dweebs in the next video.